Good evening. Hello, hello. Hello, good evening. Good evening, everybody. Good evening. Can you hear me? Yes, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Hello. Okay, let me see. I think I'm having speaker problems. No, you. I, I, I can hear you very well. We can hear you, teacher. Okay, yeah, but I, I cannot hear you in the headsets. I mean, I hear the speaker, ah. but not the headset. Oh, yeah, okay. Can you hear me? Yep. Yes. yes. Okay. Um, give me a second. I need to change headsets. Give me a second. Yes, teacher. Go oh, ahead, teacher. Thank you. Can you hear me? Yes. Yes, teacher. Excellent. Very good. Thank you. Good evening. Welcome back. Huh. Okay. I'm uh, using good, a, evening. A, good evening. I'm, I'm using a different computer. So I guess that uh, the headset is not compatible to be used in this computer. But anyways, welcome okay. back. Um, what's today's date? Yes, uh, Wednesday, Wednesday 9th. 9th. Yes, Wednesday, December 9th. Mm. What's the year? 2020. 2020. 2020. Yes. It's more, it's more easy. Yeah, it's easier to say, to say 2020. It's easier. Uh, it's easier yeah. to say 2020. Yeah, than saying 2020. Okay, good. Um, do you remember the topic we discussed yesterday? No. Transportation. Exactly. We were speaking about transportation and to be more exact, uh, most of us were discussing uh, public transportation in El Salvador. You know, and we all agree that uh, public transportation in El Salvador needs to improve a lot in different ways. Driver, units, uh, the treatment they offer, so different things. 
-hmm. When was the last time you took the bus? Mm. Have you mm -hmm. ever taken a bus? Time, time, time ago. Long time ago. Three times. Long time ago. Three times per week. Okay. Four times I I mix a full system profession with, with driving. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Last time I used public transportation was I don't know, maybe a week ago. I think so. I don't remember mm -hmm. what, but I remember uh, using public transportation recently. I think it was last Sunday. I don't remember exactly. Okay, <laughs> and what is your opinion? What is your opinion about uh, uh, public transportation? According to the situation, these days? Yeah, public transportation in El Salvador. How can it be improved? Everything. <laughs> yeah, everything needs everything. to be improved. Yes. Yeah. They have some new buses, new uh, units, uh, you know, with good condition, air condition, mm -hmm. but they charge uh, almost twice as much as the regular old buses that people usually use. So. Yep. So, for for example, the Citrams, uh -huh. that kind of buses, uh, so I suppose that they have a different condition of the regular buses. Right. Of the regular transportation. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes, I think that it offered uh, advantages to the to the people, uh, but to benefit a certain sector of the population, you know, drivers mainly, they were affected because they were mm -hmm. sacrificing one lane exclusively for the C-Trams, but. Mm -hmm. It's true. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's true. Anyways. Okay. I think that the, the problem is that the problem, we, the, don't uh -huh. we don't have a good culture of use of the regular of the public transportation because yep. we have a lot of people in all in few units or good units for for transport for transport uh -huh. yep. and then uh, there are a lot of people inside of the transportation it's a problem yeah yeah you know, and people use public transportation because they have to, because they need to. Yeah. Not uh -huh, because yeah. it's an option, you know. It's, uh, that's yeah. correct. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Anyways. Anyway. All right. So let's begin. Uh, we have two different, uh, we have a listening questionnaire. Mm -hmm. We have a listening activity that uh, is going to make you give a response about the topic. Um, we have a speaking activity as well. So let's okay. begin with the first one. I have four questions for you mm -hmm. that you need to copy. So I will okay. dictate the four questions. You copy the questions, you listen to the audio, and you try to get the answers that they ask you. Are you ready? Yeah. Wait a minute. Wait a minute, please. Go ahead. No problem. No problem. Go get your pen and paper. Yes. Or in Word. <laughs> yeah, or in Word document. Exactly. Sure. Mm -hmm. Sure. Yeah. Vilma, how are you? Uh, you're muted, Vilma. Hi, teacher. Hi, everyone. I'm sleeping. <laughs> Yes, you look tired. <laughs> what time do you wake up, Vilma? Today at uh, 5.30. 5.30. Yeah. That's a little bit early. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I know people that they wake up at 4 a.m. 
3.30 or 3 a.m. Every day, every day. Yep. Very, very tired. Yeah, so okay, I imagine, okay, good. Okay, so first question, which department is he in? That's the first question. Which department is he in? Question number two. What does he do there? What does he do there? Question three. What's the worst? What's the worst? And question number four, why does he say it's tedious? Why does he say it's tedious? Tedious. 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 Yeah. What is the meaning of tedious, Julia? Tedious. Tedious. Okay. And, and how can you explain the word tedious in English? It's something like makes you feel tired or bored, maybe. Yeah. Exactly. Uh huh. Okay. Tedious. Ah. All right. So, what is the first question, class? Which department is he in? Is he? Which department is he in? Which, which department? department is he is in? He in? Okay, which department is he in? There you have the first question. What is question number two? What do does there? he do there? What does he do there? What does he do there? What is the third question? What's, what's the worst? What's the worst? Okay, what's the worst? Words. What's the worst? What is the meaning of worst? Peor. Uh -huh. Peor o lo peor? O lo peor. Yeah, it's the superlative form of the word yeah. bad. Yes. Uh -huh. And okay. what is the last question? It's, yeah. It's with the T at the end. Yeah, with T at the end, exactly. Okay. And what is question number four? Why does he say it's tedious? Why does he say it's tedious? Why does he say it's tedious? It's... Questions. So you could compare your questions in the chat. I wrote the questions in the chat so you guys can make um, any corrections if you have to. Did you, Did you have the same? Yes. Okay, good. Yep. Are you ready for the listening? Yes. Yes. Here we go. I'm going to put you on mute so we don't have any um, interruptions. Mute. Uh -huh. Share screen. Share computer sound. And here we go. Listening. Questions one through three. Listen to part of a discussion between two friends. Hey, Sammy. How's your job at the library working out? You're at the university library, aren't you? Yeah, it's great. I've been working in the acquisitions department. Oh, what do you do there? Logging in new books, mostly. It's kind of neat because I get to open all the boxes that arrive. Boxes containing all the newly purchased books. It's kind of like a birthday, unwrapping presents. That sounds like fun. That part is, but then I have to enter each book into the computer. I don't mind that too much, 
But the worst, the worst thing is attaching the barcode on the cover. That can get kind of tedious, you know, just doing the same thing over and over again. One more time, pay attention. Listening mini test one. Questions one through three. Listen to part of a discussion between two friends. Hey, Sammy. How's your job at the library working out? You're at the university library, aren't you? Yeah, it's great. I've been working in the acquisitions department. Oh, what do you do there? Logging in new books, mostly. It's kind of neat because I get to open all the boxes that arrive. Boxes containing all the newly purchased books. It's kind of like a birthday, unwrapping presents. That sounds like fun. That part is, but then I have to enter each book into the computer. I don't mind that too much, but the worst, the worst thing is attaching the barcode on the cover. That can get kind of tedious, you know, just doing the same thing over and over again. Do you have the four answers? Do you? I think yes. Okay. We understand the number two. Okay. Got it. Okay. Who else has the four answers? Me. Okay. Who has three answers? Two answers? I, I guess me. Okay. Fine. All right. Let's do it together. Um, which department is he in? The library of the university. Three. But which department? Acquisition department. Acquisition department. Yes. How do you spell it? Okay. Let me write it right now. That is the acquisition. Acquisition department. Department. Acquisition department. You see it? Uh, yeah. Acquisition. Acquisition department. What is the acquisition uh, department? Maybe like supply chain? No. Uh, buy some new things. Like the buying department. Yes. Now, you know, companies are distributed in different forms. In the States, the acquisition department is the area where they receive the orders that are arriving. How do you say bodega in Spanish? Warehouse. 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 Right. Warehouse. The warehouse. The warehouse. So the acquisition department, you know, like, okay, we're expecting 10,000 books. So I have a lot of work for today because I'm in the acquisition department. Right? But like I said, companies are distributed in different forms. Maybe in your company, uh, it's not the acquisition. Maybe it's reception. Maybe it's the owner. Maybe it's, you know, they, they're distributed in different forms. But the acquisition department is where, uh, where they receive the orders. Yep. What does he do there? Who has number two? He log in new books. Log in exactly. new books. Yeah. Logging in Logging new in. books. What is the meaning of logging in new books? Maybe he received the books and he has to check like an inventory. Okay. Like yes. Catalog. My catalog. But how do you say the in the in a library when you have the codes? And yeah, you you, uh, you file. Ah, you file. Yeah. Yeah, so I have 20 wow. new dictionaries. I got 20 dictionaries. And I work in a library. As a librarian, what is my next function? I have 20 new dictionaries. What am I supposed to do? Log them in? Yeah, exactly. Uh -huh, so in. now they exist physically, but they also need to exist in the system, right? Okay. 
uh, what's the worst? I'm not sure, but I hear about something like it's attaching the covers. Aha. <laughs> uh -huh. Attach barcode in the cover. Uh -huh. Exactly. Barcode. Attaching the barcode on the cover. The barcode. Ah, wow. Okay. Attaching the barcode on the cover. What is the barcode? And what is the function? To make a registry of the product, maybe. Uh huh. Yeah, yeah. So you have like a like a machine here. You pass the book, you pass the barcode, and it reads. And why does it say it's tedious? Repeating it again. It again and again. And the same same thing, thing always. It's a routine. Yeah, yeah. It's a routine. It's the same thing over yep. and over again. Exactly. Yeah, it's like when you're working in a call center, uh, if you work for a specific account, you will do exactly the same thing again and again and again and again. Right. Yeah. So at the beginning, you know, people feel like, oh, this is cool, I need it, you know, like blah, blah, blah. But I think that a few weeks after, you're like, man, am I gonna be doing this for the next, what, how many months, how many years? So, true. Okay, any questions? No? No, no. Okay, so let's do some speaking. Then we go back to material from the platform. Um, let me see this here. What country Where? is that? Uh, you mean my... my mm -hmm. uh, the wallpaper the screen. yes oh that's uh, does anybody recognize this picture the hospital rosales yeah hospital rosales right hospital rosales yeah um, decades ago many uh, years ago uh, time ago the 50 i think it's before the 40s 40s yeah. 40s or even before. 30s yeah, for... you see the car style? Uh, uh -huh, for the car styles. Ah, so and, and look at the bus. In look the at the bus. Bochos. The bus, yeah. Like bochos. Yeah. Wow, very, very beautiful. Picture. Yeah, it's a it's a nice picture, yes. You know, like yes. uh like you imagine you go back in time and you say, Man, I mean, sometimes I wish I could have lived in these years, you know, where everything was way more natural, you know, a different lifestyle and everything, but, mm -hmm. okay, so, um, you know, I'm using a computer that I really usually don't use because the one was giving me issues and the other computer was the one that was already prepared for today's lesson and I now have to We'll be talking about first times. Do you remember your first time of kindergarten? Do you? No. I didn't go to I... kindergarten. Oh, you didn't go to kindergarten. Okay. Let me see. No. Do you remember the first time? Well, if you're married, maybe you're not going to answer this one, but remember the first time you fell in love? Oh, you don't want to remember. Okay, good. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. You may have your uh, good reasons. Okay, let me see this here. Okay, so these are the questions that you will be discussing. Everything uh, brings you back to the first time you did something. Do you remember your first car? Do you remember yes. your first car? Yes. Okay. Okay, eight to nine. Eight to nine. All right. <laughs> uh -huh. Okay. 
Okay. So let me um, let me get your partner ready. Five pairs out of room. Here we go. It's loading. that was in a cyber cafe in uh, uh, near the, of the, my old house mm -hmm. and he paid around four dollars per hour something like that I'm, I, I don't remember around maybe the year was 2000 or 1999 yeah and I was like 11 or 12 years yeah. that's my, my first time but yeah I remember that it was ex expensive you paid it because you need it, not because you want to You sound choppy, Arania. Sorry? You sound choppy. Choppy? Yeah, choppy. Do you remember the meaning of the word choppy? Uh, I, like, I know the meaning of chop. Yeah. I can make a relationship. Uh -huh. Right, right. So like, when someone tells you, hey, you sound choppy, that means uh, that your voice is not clear. Okay, maybe it is my, my internet because it has been having trouble since the afternoon. Now you sound better. Now you sound good. Ah, uh, okay. I was, I was uh, saying to Irene that the first use the internet was when I was in seventh or eighth grade for investigations for, for the elementary school. And the, the, the usage that I gave to the internet was mostly for, for homework. Okay. And, for social media like uh, Facebook. When did when did you finish your high school, uh, Irania? When? Yeah, what year did you finish your high school? Uh, Two thousand eleven. Two thousand eleven. Yeah, two thousand eleven. Yes. Internet was very popular already. Yes. Okay. Mostly because of Facebook, because I started to use it in 2010, I think, or nine. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right, okay. good. You can hear the, the sound. <laughs> <laughs> Did you remember oh that? God. Uh huh. Yes, you have to connect the telephone line to your PC mm -hmm. and you have to wait. To answer the, uh -huh. the modding. <laughs> That's uh <-huh>. true. <laughs> Very complicated. <laughs> yes, I, I was installing that modding in that mm -hmm. time. I I went time I didn't have in my house, just uh, in my job. Oh so sure. I enjoy like working in there. <laughs> Because for me it was very, very new everything, and I yes. in, I could to contact many uh, relatives or in friends for using that means. Yes, mm -hmm. I, I remember that 
because I, I work there in the company providing mm -hmm. internet, like mm -hmm. yes, ISP, but mm -hmm. uh, we don't have it. <laughs> but they uh -huh. give us, they gave, they gave us the, some uh -huh. you feel. I feel very happy because I think it was very awesome that we went to the cinema and eat popcorn and soda and enjoy with the with my mom and my uh, sister and that we going to that cinema. It was the uh, universal universal cinema. I think was the name. Uh -huh. Downtown? Uh, near from the... No, no. It was in the... the near from the Salvador del Mundo. The Caribbean cinema. cinema. Was, it, was, ah, okay. it was right in front of the Salvador del Mundo. Mm -hmm. okay. uh, yes, I, I remember that. I, I was... I see that in the that cinema I uh, had the beauty and the beast or lion king and how do you feel when you see the the first movie in the cinema uh, i feel i felt great uh, i felt uh, happiness and i went to see the last treasure or let me let me remember the the first uh, movie of indiana jones uh, no, it wasn't the Last Treasure. Last Treasure was was another movie. Uh -huh. uh, it was the, something the of first, the first uh, island, I Indiana think. Jones. I yeah. had uh, the franchise, Franz uh, franchise. Uh, I it think was like it, the. Uh huh. Uh, it, it had. They, it, they were eating. Go ahead. Tell me. Go ahead. Go ahead. <laughs> no, I saw that that. I saw that they, they were eating a uh, monkey's brain in a in a banquet. Okay. And I saw and saw Indiana Jones also running, making many things. So for me, it was great Which, because it was an adventure movie. Which movie uh, theater did you go see that movie? I went to see it at Santa Lucia. Oh, Cine Santa Lucia, Santa oh. Lucia Cinema. Is, that is in Ilopango. At Ilopango is located, was located at Ilopango. Yeah, now it's so a supermarket. Like, uh -huh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Was was good, but I I can I can recall the the the, the name of the first movie of the Indiana. Yeah, movie. I think it was something so, Indiana yes. Jones and in, in something Perdido. I, I think I'm not sure. And the lost uh, uh the lost up uh, the lost treasure or the lost world? No, the lost world know. is Jurassic Park. I don't the know. Lost, I really don't know. Lost skin. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah. Was awesome. Okay. <laughs> I know. Well, when was the first time you used a mobile phone? Phone. Uh -huh. Who did okay. you call? E in the in the my first time I used to the mm -hmm. mobile phone. I remember what I was. Uh, mm -hmm. Let me see. Um, the year uh twenty. Mm -hmm. Let me see twenty. Yes, it. I visit Honduras. And Guatemala too. Yes. I never been in Honduras. Never. Just in Guatemala, but Honduras. Uh, yes. I don't know. My sister lived there in Honduras, and I visit. I visited. I visit to her. I visit to her with my parents. With my no, with my father. Uh, and I visit when I was in Honduras. I'm sorry. You traveled by bus, or I, I, I can hear you. I was asking you if you use the bus. By bus, yes, by. Bus. Okay. Yes, I traveled by bus. Yeah, by bus. Nice. Mm -hmm. 
And I, when I stay in, when I stay in, in Honduras, I visited, I, I don't know, what is the name of this? Is the, the past tense or the, the principle of the verb think? In this case, is the past tense of the verb think. Uh -huh. in, in my case, Anania, for me, it was ba basically the, the cell phone when I have uh, the first cell phone because only I use uh, for for calls, right? Uh, nowadays, in, in the in, in my cell phone, <laughs> camera, uh, um, maybe chat education, um, the hour, <laughs> uh, all, mm -hmm. <laughs> all. No. It's very important. Yeah, now the, the, the cell phones are better because they have a lot of tools. Yeah, yeah okay. Yeah. Okay, and, and what about the, the question number four that says, when was the first time it was great? Uh, the, this is my, my answer. Uh, for me, in my dog, in my dog life, it was great. Uh, the, the first time is very, very important about the, 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 my first cell phone, right? Because it was necessary for, for calls. Because uh, okay. the public, the public phone, uh, this uh, or there aren't. Was in another country, but the first time was Guatemala. Uh, okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. I, I I I couldn't go to Guatemala when I was younger. No, when really? I was a child. Uh -huh. the first time I I went out uh -huh. to the country was maybe in 2000 was working in, uh -huh. in Newcom I was working in Newcom another company of communication uh -huh. I okay. I have to go to Canada 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 uh -huh. I have and, family in Canada but I never I, I never go, I never have gone uh, okay I went maybe uh, eh, 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 Ontario uh -huh. in Quebec. I was there for wow, 15 nice. years because we were receiving a, a training. So I, I got a chicken pox there. <laughs> oh, okay, of course. <laughs> no, I got a chicken pox. Oh, really? Oh, yes. nice. Okay. How many days no, did it, you have the chicken pox? The, yes, I was in the training just for three days until oh. they checked me. The conchitas, uh -huh. they, yeah, the they, spots. Uh -huh. the spot, they, mm -hmm. they put me out. They <laughs> are the, oh. wow. so I was, I was inside the hotel for maybe, let me see, nine or ten days, and mm -hmm. isolated. Huh? Isolated. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Isolated, yes. Quarantine. And, and, yeah, like quarantine. And I, like quarantine. Yeah. quarantine and, and the doctor was there with me and two or three times every day. And I was to be light on the, on, in a pina. In, in, a, in a tub. Mm -hmm. oh, uh, tub. A tub. And she put me a lot of ice in my body, man. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's the treatment. The the best thing is when I have to come back because I we have to to go to the USA or continue the training. So mm -hmm. I was in that time after 15 days, I have a big ronchita. How do you say? Ya no me acuerdo. What? The Chicken pox. Oh, the spots. Yeah, but the spots. Spot. Spot. Yeah. S P O T. S P O T. Yeah. Okay. The spot and the doctor uh, put me at the morning around two a.m. a lot of maquillaje. Makeup. She mm -hmm. makeup. Mm -hmm. 
and I have to use a, a jacket, a jacket, uh -huh. and a jacket, and a cup, and I have to travel to USA. <laughs> when I arrived there, they checked me, and they they let me in. <laughs> they didn't let me. <laughs> yeah. Wow. And, and I forgot my shoes and uh, how do you say, maleta de mano, handbag. Yeah, handbag. Mm -hmm. In Canada. So I have to pay to pick up. Okay. <laughs> but, Uh, about the smoke I don't understand mm -hmm. cigars uh -huh. Uh -huh. Okay. because my grandpa used to chew tobacco uh -huh. so they, I was used to see the, the cigars but mm -hmm. uh, I was in the, uh, in the I was in the US I told you and then mm -hmm. and then some people had to the smoke, my grandpa's, my grandpa's pura. I, 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 I try the mom. Um, so it was great, you know, when, you, when you you're smoking. The, yeah, when you're you smoking. the difference when, with cigarettes and cigars. Uh -huh. when, when you smoke cigars, uh, you feel like a, uh, like a vanilla test, taste. Vanilla taste or something. The smoke is really heavy. It's, it's disgusting. Yeah, it's strong. It's the, strong. The, uh, it's a strong the smell. But, but if you are smoking, oh, you, you feel happy. You, <laughs> you feel great. But thanks to God, thanks to God, I don't smoke. I mean, maybe once in a, in a year. Or, but no, I don't. But I drink uh, uh, maybe six, six beers in a week. Or, or how do you say, a drinks, a drinks per day, one drink per day, maybe, no, one drink per day, or or six in a, in, in one day, something like that. <laughs> okay. Well, it's the way it is. Yeah. <laughs> so. Uh, All right. I, 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 I remember the same thing. I was in, yes, in, I was in my home and got at home and, and sometimes the bullets of the, of the yes. both sides, uh, the, the, the ejército, how do you say, ejército and the, the, the gorilla. Yes. Mm -hmm. How do you say? Gestures. Did you say gestos? Yes. Gestures. No, no. Uh, no, no. The, when it's the dangerous uh, in, in, in uh, and was when the ejército se enfrentaba a la guerrilla. A la guerrilla. Okay, when the army fought the guerrilla. <laughs> uh, mm -hmm. ah. and, 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 um, and you have yes. to 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 hide. Mm -hmm. Below the the bells, <laughs> under the bed. To... Yep, uh, that yes. happened to me a couple and of times. Was... Yep.
All right, all right. Any questions about, <coughs> I'm sorry. Any questions about uh, when you did certain things the first time? No? It was interesting to, to, to remember that times. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Do you remember your first job? Yes, okay. I do. Do you remember yes, of course. when you graduated from high school? Yeah. Yes. Mm -hmm. Do you remember when you graduated from primary? Yeah. From sixth mm -hmm. grade? Mm -hmm. No, really. Okay. <laughs> do you remember when you were in first grade? Yes. No, really. I remember when I was in first grade. Yes, I remember. Yes, I remember. Because in, at that time, there is no kinder. <laughs> <laughs> I went to kinder too, you know. In <laughs> kindergarten, in first grade, I did him in a, in a public school near no downtown San Salvador. Nice memories, nice memories. Uh -huh. Anyways, okay, so let me show you this right here. Oh, yes. Must be this one. Yeah. Okay, give me a second. Oh my God, it's, it's not my computer. Oh, it is my computer, but I, I, I haven't used this one in a while. Anyways, okay, there is a section in the, in the, in the platform that they give you a topic. Uh, they said, uh, scientists believe that having pets can help you feel better. And they ask you for your opinion. They ask you to give an example and to give any, um, any experiences that you may have with the, with the topic. So once again, remember there are two types of, of, of TOEFL exam. You have the paper base that evaluates only listening, reading and grammar. And you also have the IBT test. Uh, the second one, they evaluate the four macro skills, listening, speaking, reading, writing, plus grammar, plus grammar. So listening, speaking, reading, writing, those are the four macro skills. What is the name of grammar? If it's not a macro skill, what is it? It's a sub skill, it's a sub skill. So when you're talking about sub skills, that means that uh, you can communicate without it you can communicate without it so it's not as important as the other as the other four so imagine you're taking the ibt exam and they tell you that experts scientists they believe that having pets uh, make you feel more relaxed they ask you for your opinion they ask you to give examples and if you have any personal experiences related with the question they ask you to mention it. So when they ask you, please give an example, when you're giving your speech, you have to mention uh, an example about, the, uh, about what you are answering. Is it clear? Is it clear? Yeah. Yes. Mm, no, 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 no. Or, 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 or for example, they said, uh, do you prefer your best friend to be similar to you or different than you? Explain your answers, give examples, and, and you must give an example, something that you have experienced before. So if you have a best friend, do you prefer your best friend to be similar or different to you? Similar. 
What do you think? Or maybe not necessarily your best friend, but someone close to you. Do you prefer this person to be similar to you or different than you? Personally, I think that I prefer a friend to be similar to me because that let us share many experiences because we are like the same things or we are going to be interested in the same activities or okay that's a good valid point like he said well i prefer my best friend to be similar to me because we will share the same likes and dislikes so therefore we will do things together does anybody have a different answer like does anybody prefer your best friend to be different to you anybody uh-huh or everybody agrees with Irenia. Everybody prefers your best friend to be similar to you? Yes, similar in the same um, preferences. I don't know. <laughs> but yes, but but not in the same temperament. Not the same thinking? <laughs> the same temperament or because if someone is introvert with someone introvert you don't you don't want to talk <laughs> and and in the case someone is introvert and the other is extrovert you can be more um, have a, a good conversation. <laughs> okay, right. Or what if one of the two is making things uh, in that way? Okay, or, 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 or if one of the two is doing things the wrong way, you're, if, if you are the same, the other person will say, yeah, it's okay, go ahead, do it. But what if the person, if your best friend is different? From doing wrong things. And the influence. Right. Right. So I, I agree with Rocio. I, I think it was Rocio that said it. That, you know, like, if you're talking about likes and dislikes, yeah, someone similar. So we will go to the movie together, we'll go to the park together, and, and things. But then... Uh, I think that it would be good to have a best friend different to you. So it takes you have someone that can correct you. Got it? Yes. Okay. Any questions or comments before you guys are dismissed? No. No? Okay. So uh, thank you very much for making the space, making the time. I will be seeing you tomorrow at eight o'clock. Have a good night. Okay, good night. See you later. Good night. Francisco. Yes, sir. Maybe I, I won't be maybe I won't be able to more because I have to work very late. Maybe. Okay. Okay, good. Thanks for telling me. Supposedly I will finish eight, but I'm not sure. Okay. Thank you for letting me know. Okay. See Thank you. you, Jose. All right. Have a good night, everybody. Bye. Bye. Bye bye. Good night. Good night, everybody.